So I grew up in uh, Kauai, Hawaii, a beautiful place in the world. Coffee everywhere, I was surrounded by it. But I never felt uh, it being so special to me as it is now. I left Kauai for the uh, bright lights of Las Vegas, where I pursued a degree in hotel management. Years passed and I felt like I needed more. So I went back to Kauai, regrouped for a little bit, and then I took off. But I really found a special place in, uh, in Indonesia. Ended up meeting a, uh, a man traveling the world on his bicycle, and he ended up being very inspirational to me. He was a coffee roaster from France. We became really good friends, and I ended up taking vigorous notes and just spending as much time as I could with this guy. It was, it was a really nice time in my life, and I felt like I might have found something. I was really, really intrigued. And of course, from a guy traveling the world on a bicycle, who wouldn't be? Ordered the little home roaster, and I bought some raw beans from Indonesia, and I had them waiting for me when I got back. I started roasting, and I wasn't really very good at it. Kept trying and trying and working harder and harder and just trying to get these little tiny roasts to taste good. My real passion is in the whole sourcing of the coffee and everything from the roasting of the coffee back found a nice warehouse space and decided to just keep it simple. The coffees that we roast here are from small micro lots and collaborative efforts and co-ops around the world. We, we only want to support these kinds of people as well. Um, it's something that we care about. That way we can provide a product that isn't just about, you know, making money, but making sure that the money goes into the right hands. The ocean has a way of uh, renewing someone, making you feel like whatever it is that may have happened in your life disappears and you just feel like it all went out the window and all you care about is surfing and that's it. And, and with coffee roasting, you get a very similar connection. hotel wanted it, a restaurant wanted it, my friends and family wanted it, and next thing you know I figured, hey this could be a little bit of a business. There, there's something about roasting that is just so attractive, and I think any coffee roaster could tell you that. I'm going to work really hard the rest of my life to make sure that what I do has a benefit to this world. At the moment, working with these coffee farmers and bringing sustainable coffees from micro lots all over the world and roasting them in these nano batches, this is what I want to do. We want to be a handcrafted part of your life, part of your day. I mean, when you really look back at coffee, it might be the only consistency you have throughout the week. And we want to make sure that that's something that we can help you with.